left off trying to get past the uh, flying thing. Messing up, so I'll do this time with the floods and stuff. Trying to focus. How's everyone doing, by the way? I hope you guys are doing okay. Getting frustrated trying to deal with this, but I'm gonna be quiet here for a minute or two. One. Don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my win means something. Eh, you're not terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. Challenge accepted, then. Perhaps you have what it takes after all. We shall see. But don't get your hopes up. The next course near Irondale offers a much tougher challenge. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium, where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Albie Weeks. I really love this coat. I, never I wonder if there's an option to, like, display it. We need to go back to... Obviously, but since we're here... Hmm. Let's see. Oh yeah, we need to meet Sebastian. Let's find the room of... Is it a requirement or recruitment? Try to figure out which possible. I guess we can go to the... I don't know if I want to go to the instructor. Let's go to the charms class. I'm a flu teleporter. I think he was hungry. More like he doesn't like you. Balthasar loves me. I'm his best friend. I would think a puff means best friend. I think just remind me of the one book. I can't remember it's name, but they would burn books in order for people not to read. It was that they against the law in the book to not be able to read. Professor Weasley? Hmm. Somewhere away from prying eyes. Thank 
everything is okay and fine in here. I just have to take the time to look. Forgive me, the headmaster stopped me and I... Merlin's beard. I see you've wasted no time. Well done. Shall we? After you, Professor. Maybe once we go back to Hogsmeade, we'll go to the salon and get her hair changed because it really is irritating to look at now. Compared to how I felt about it when we first got it. What is this place? This is the womb of requirement. It only appears when one is in real need of it. Ordinarily, Rebellion might stumble upon this room entirely by accident. If ever. I'd only planned to suggest to you how to find it by walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need. But you've managed to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. Now, where is Deke? He must have sneaked past and gone ahead. Deke, Professor? The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. There's no chance I'm... This presents the perfect opportunity to teach you Evanesco, the vanishing spell. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. I suggest you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs away. The X triangle, X square triangle, X triangle, X square triangle. Depending on what system you guys are playing this game, if you're playing it like on the Xbox Splendid. or... Now, cast Evanesco on those chairs. Or on Switch or on PC, it's going to be different. Excellent work. Pavelli, you will note that you are now in possession of Moonstone. We shall discuss its uses later. Let's move on. Where in Merlin's name is that elf? Thank you much, Larry. Is that goodness? My old school bag. I wondered where that had got to. I can't believe it's still here. I'll just take a quick look at this. Give you an opportunity to explore on your own until we locate Deke. Yes, Professor. <gasps> Dear me. Can't you keep it down? Some of us are trying to rest. Rebellion. Well, that's not even showing me, though. I was gonna go back to see if there was like a spot because once we get to where we need to be in this room of requirement, we won't be able to access any chests and stuff anymore because oh, we're changing to the needs of our character. Revelia. Oh, 
rebellion. Let's see. This isn't as precarious as it looks. Revelio. An intruder! Stop them! other than a house elf managed to get around in here. You should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I might have to look back at the video because I don't remember seeing a golden snitch.
I hope that house elf can find us in here. Well, I don't want to go too far because... Let 
Try back and said that I know I wasted so much time doing trying to do this, but Struggling. Yikes, careful. Huh? Oh, there you are. Wait right there. Deke will come to you. Apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. Is this the student? Indeed it is. Deke is honored to meet you. Deke has been a friend since I was a second year. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. The Room of Requirement will always be equipped for the Seeker's needs. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. Deep-seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them. You seem to have accessed it in its form as the Room of Hidden Things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. Now, it's time to focus on what you need. Just close your eyes. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will do the rest. Later on. I look forward to seeing what you do with the space. Ah, and it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify unfamiliar items of clothing. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. This will be more useful when I have something to identify. 
You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. Let's do a quick save. It's been a while since we did a save. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. Now, I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes, the magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. All right, so we need to do an X, X square, triangle, and X. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Spellcrafts are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources needed to conjure a particular object. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls in Hogsmeade. I did. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, it's much safer and easier to purchase them. They can also be collected by vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I see. Can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You can indeed. Hmm, quite perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magical plots and brew potions in class. whenever you need to brew potions or grow plants. Presuming, of course, you've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds. be here to answer any questions you may have. Do not underestimate his insights. Can I use this type of transfiguration magic outside of the room? Conjuring and vanishing are strictly forbidden elsewhere in the castle. We've charms in place to enforce that. It would be exhausting to reverse the errors in both judgment and magic. But the room of requirement has its own rule. 
Bones. Can you tell me a bit more about Deke? He's been at Hogwarts longer than I have, and seems to know it's every nook, cranny, and secret. We discovered this room together when I was a student. Deke has had a good deal of experience, both here at Hogwarts and at a previous post. I shall let Deke tell you more when he's ready, but again, you would be wise to listen to any suggestions he may have. I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer in case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. Very well. First, you'll need to gather some Moonstone. You can acquire it by vanishing items here in the Room of Requirement, or you can gather it carefully outside of the Hogwarts grounds. Return to me once you've gathered enough, and we shall begin the lesson. All right. Let's do a save. Looks like we have an outpost. All right, guys, just... Complete the tasks I've given you, and then meet me in my classroom to learn Defindo, the severing charm. It's typically used to cut an object, but can be a powerful weapon when needed. Let's see if it will do another auto save. It might. All right, so I might just leave the game here guys and we'll continue in the next one thanks for stopping by and watching